Welcome back. We continue with more local stories. Ghana has been urged to institute a minerals audit agency to have first-hand information on the quality and quantity of minerals produced at the various mines. The chief executive of the Tanzania Minerals Audit Agency, Dominic Rukeza, who advised other African countries to learn from Tanzania, said the introduction of the minerals audit agency has quadrupled Tanzania's minerals royalties. Tanzania is an Eastern African country with over 45 million population and has discovered 10 minerals including the Tanzanite mineral which is only mined in Tanzania as well as gold which contributes about 94% of Tanzania's mineral exports. Despite being surrounded by conflict-ridden countries, Tanzania is quietly and vigorously developing its infrastructure and institutions. This is evident in its highly developed commercial capital, Dar es Salaam, which could be mistaken for a city in the developed world. For Ghana to learn from successes of the extractive industry in Tanzania, the Institute of Financial and Economic Journalists, IFEG, with support from GIZ and CECO, organized some Ghanaian journalists to visit the Tanzania Minerals Audit Agency, which has been credited for ensuring transparency within the Tanzanian extractive industry. The CEO of the agency, after briefing the IFEG team, told Vasatua News that their auditing has quadrupled Tanzania's royalties, hence African countries must follow suit. You know, we do the minerals monitoring, you know, we station mineral auditors, full-time mineral auditors at all major, major, major mines, and uh, these full-time mineral auditors, they ensure that all the, the production which takes place at the mine sites are not supposed, these mines are not supposed to you know, to produce any gold, so to say, without the presence of these minorities. They take samples, whereby these samples are, are, you know, are being sent to TMA laboratory in Dar es Salaam for checking assay results with those provided by the mines. Without knowing the, the answer contents, you know, you know, you cannot, uh, you cannot be sure of the, of the mineral products, you know, whether uh, in terms of what, what amount of pay payment in terms of royalties are supposed to, to be paid. I simply call upon you know, other African countries to emulate you know, the example Tanzania has, has taken in terms of you know, establishing an institution responsible solely for monitoring you know, mining activities. The Tanzania Minerals Audit Agency also ensure an environmental auditing for the preservation of the environment despite mining. The IFED team also interacted with the Tanzanian Extractive Industry Transparency Initiative, which is spearheading extractive industry transparency and has influenced mineral policy reviews. Other civil society organizations, including the Tanzania Natural Resource Governance Institute and the Tanzanian Environmental Journalists Association, all briefed the IFED team on their experiences, and this, the IFED president says, it is useful to members. So very, very, very important and it's very, very, very essential. I think our media owners and managers must take these uh, external tours very seriously. They should not think that, you know, stay or sitting in, you know, in the newsroom is enough. Journalists must be made to go out so that they can see what is happening outside their environment and they come back home and compare. Beside the experiences Ghanaian journalists are taking from the Tanzanian extractive industry, the beautiful, magnificent structures here that have been engineered by the extractive industry is something that they cannot forget. For Vasatwa News, I am Kwesi Ejeenim, Dar es Salaam, in Tanzania.